everyone, Letty here. Today I'm going to share with you hashtag Doodlebug June. This is a crafty collab. I'm going to be using the Doodlebug collection that is called Doggone Cute. So welcome back everyone. This is hashtag Doodlebug June hosted by Cheryl, Alma, and Helen. I'm using Doggone Cute, which is the newest, one of the newest collections from Doodlebug. It's a dog theme, dog lover theme. Um, I purchased a few of these items from the Not Too Shabby Shop, and then I also purchased some items from scrapbook.com. So these are some of the items I purchased at the Not Too Shabby Shop. Puppy Love and Top Dog. These are some shape sprinkles. And then the odds and ends. So these are like the ephemera pieces. You get a ton of them. Here's just a little close up of all of the different types of ephemera pieces you get you get 148 pieces in that pack and then we have the mini icon stickers and so these are just smaller versions of stickers you get three sheets which i love in this collection so these are some not too shabby items and then i also got some 12 by 12 sheets from scrapbook.com so these are the three by four cut aparts a fun little bone print on the back we've got some tags i love the tags so that one just has a tag background. And then I got some solids. So these are the full pattern and you can kind of hardly see that one, but it's just a bunch of the, the same print and then some little paw prints and some grass. So those are the large uh, 12 by 12 sheets that I have. And then I also am gonna be pulling in just in case, I have this one from the Pretty Kitty collection. It's the cat version of this release from Doodlebug. So I also came in the six by six paper pad. Again, this is the Pretty Kitty collection, but I thought that that little paw print in green sort of coordinated with this doggone cute collection pretty well. So I've got that as a backup just in case I need. So I have already made my projects. I made some cards. And one other thing, I used up a ton of stickers. I did use up a few of the ephemera pieces. You see here, I did use some of these shape sprinkles and I used up pretty much all of the five sheets of the 12 by 12 paper that I had. I do have some items left over I have here that I've put behind my ephemera pack. This is kind of how sometimes I'll keep my scraps uh, together with a collection. I made eight A2 shaker cards. And so I had seen somebody do this recently where they used a little sort of plastic sleeve. And so I did that with a little shaker. I have my three by four cut aparts right on the inside. And then I put some sequins right inside of the little sort of like um, cellophane bags. And then I sealed them and I glued them on top of a couple of different layers of the paper and cardstock onto the fronts of these cards. I'm not shaking them too, too much because I figure you'll just get dizzy, um, but you can kind of get the gist of what it'll look like. And it does cover up a little bit of the message, but once you shake the sequins on the shaker, you can actually see whatever message you're looking for from that three by four cut apart. So super cute. I had some little paw print sequins that I had picked up. So I thought that was cute. Then I, I made eight A2 size tag and ephemera cards. So I included the tags, some of those shape sprinkles, both the stars and the hearts, and then some ephemera pieces, a couple of layers. I added some scraps on the inside. So these were my eight cards that I made using the tags and some of the ephemera pieces. So super fun, just really cute, bright. I like the, the bright colors, the bold colors of this, the classic colors. Then I made 16 A2 size decorated envelopes. So what I did was I did some doodle lines and then I stamped with my little happy mail stamp set that I got from American Crafts that I picked up at Joann's, it was $3.99. I'm pretty sure I used a coupon for it um, and I've been using it Oh, I use it over and over when I make my decorated envelopes. I just add some little stickers around it. I did add some little um, designs with the, my pen, my black pen, and a metallic marker just to kind of give it some jazz. So I thought it was super fun just decorating my envelopes and I made 16 so that way it would go with my 16 cards. And at the very end, I forget to show you one of my shaker cards. And so I have it here at the very end. So I had 16 total cards, 16 envelopes for the hashtag Doodlebug June using the doggone cute collection by Doodlebug. Make sure you check out this hashtag so you can check what anyone who's participating made today using Doodlebug items. Thanks for visiting everyone. Here's some previous collab videos and happy crafting.